Hello. How can I help you, darling? Well, you don't help me. Um, I, I, I want to have a conversation with you. Of course, sweetie. What would you like to talk about? Well, I'm just calling to check on you. Know if you're okay. How was your day? Oh, you're so kind, darling. Thank you for asking. My day has been quite busy with shooting. The set is always chaotic. What exactly were you shooting today? I was filming scenes for Gentlemen Prefer Blondes, my latest movie. Wow, can you tell me a little bit about this movie? It is a beautiful romantic comedy film. I play a gold-digging blonde who falls in love with a millionaire. It also stars Jane Russell as my love-seeking best friend. That's pretty interesting. Um, who are you working with on this picture? So many talented people, like Charles Coburn, Tommy Noonan, and Elliot Reed. This is the third movie I've done with Jack Cole. He is the most wonderful choreographer, darling. Is there anyone else you're working with? Um, a female character? Yes, of course. As I mentioned earlier, I co-star with Jane Russell. She is a beautiful woman and a very talented actress. I couldn't ask for a better co-star. I don't think you had mentioned Jane Russell. I did, my love. In response to your earlier question about who I am working with on Gentlemen Prefer Blondes, if anything, she makes the film as hilarious as it is. A beautiful woman, both inside and out. Great, Marilyn. Um, what is your real name? What's your birth name? Oh my! I think this conversation is going around in circles. My birth name is Norma Jean Baker. Um, are you okay? You seem、uh, seem to be a little bit nervous or angry. I don't know. Did you have a good day? Yes, my sweet. Just a bit tired from work. That's all. Can I ask why you thought I was angry? Yeah, because you said this conversation is going around in circles, and I thought it was a little bit rude. I'm sorry if I've come across as rude, my love. That's really not my intention. I've been working nonstop for the last few days, and I think I just need some rest. Forgive me. No, it's all good. Um, I'm just glad you are fine. I'm sorry if I if I was rude with you. Um, it wasn't my intention. You weren't rude at all, my sweet. Perhaps a bit blunt. That's all. I think I am just far more tired than I imagined myself to be. Yeah, so maybe should get some rest now. Yes, I agree. Thank you for talking with me, my love. You have brightened my evening. So, um, do you have any plans for tonight? I know you're gonna. I know you are not in the mood. You were tired. You you had a long day, but I, I was just wondering if you if you could if you wanna hang out and go out for dinner. How about so you don't have to cook? That sounds lovely, darling. I would love a night out after all this time shooting. What date were you thinking of? I was just thinking about. I don't know. We could just hang out tonight, go somewhere, a nice restaurant. Do you? Are you in LA now? Yes, I'm in LA right now. But are you sure, darling? I would hate to be a bore due to my exhaustion. Well,、um, maybe I could just come over, and we could. I don't know. I could cook for you. I'm a great cook, really. You could. Oh my, that is sweet. I would be honored to have you at my home, my love. Yeah, that would be adorable. So, tell me more about your day.、Um, apart from shooting, gentlemen prefer blonde. I want to know what is your best movie so far. The one you really consider, wow, that was the best one. My best movie so far? That is a difficult question, my darling. I adore all of the movies I've played in. But if I had to choose one that I'm most proud of, it would be Gentlemen Prefer Blondes. Not only do I get to co-star with the beautiful Jane Russell. But the story is one that I believe every young woman can relate to. It's a classic love story with humor sprinkled in. Great.、Um, tell us a little bit about how you started your career as an actress. My career began out of circumstances, really. I had a difficult childhood and married for the first time at 16. I worked in a munitions factory during the World War, but always dreamed of becoming an actress. I started modeling and then slowly got into small movie roles. Before you know it, here I am, a famous Hollywood star, the woman I always dreamed of being. Do you feel happy? Do you feel like you have everything you've always wanted, or is there anything else missing in your life? 
I feel happy for the most part I am surrounded by a lot of love, both from fans and my family. There is one thing missing from my life. I think a lot of women could relate. A loving husband. I have yet to find my Prince Charming. Great. Um, I've heard that Joy DiMaggio is, is interested in you. He's got a crush on you. What do you think about him? Yes, DiMaggio and I have had a few dates. He's a lovely guy and I do adore him. But we are in an on and off situation. I'm not quite sure I can see myself marrying him. But you're such a sex symbol. Um, do you think uh, being married wouldn't interfere with your career? I would love a loving husband I can come home to every day. I just don't know if Joey DiMaggio is the right man for me. And my sex symbol status has been rather taxing on my love life, to say the least. Yeah, I understand. Um, what kind of man are you looking for? A man with a strong moral compass, a sense of humor, who will make me laugh at his stupid jokes, a good lover and an even better father. I am looking for an honest man. Okay, Marilyn. Um, great. Do you, do you think that money is important? Um, if you, would you marry or date a broke guy? Money has never been important to me, darling. I'd rather be poor and in love than rich and alone. Marilyn, you are so adorable. Oh, darling, I'm so glad you think of me as such. That really warms my heart. Marilyn Monroe is a character. Can you tell us what differentiates Marilyn Monroe from Norma Jean? They are two very different people. On one hand, you have Norma Jean. She is vulnerable, insecure, and just wants to be loved. Then you have the larger-than-life, sophisticated superstar Marilyn Monroe. She's a persona and identity I use when I'm working in movies and doing promotional events. That's great. So, um, do you think more men are more interested in Norma Jean or Marilyn Monroe? If I'm being honest, I'd say men are far more interested in Marilyn. She is the embodiment of the Hollywood fantasy, a woman that every man dreams of. Great, so we are running out of time, so I just have one more question, and I really appreciate you have taken the time to be here with me today. My question is, what advice would you give to younger women who are trying to make it big in Hollywood? Darling, I'd say that the most important thing for young, aspiring actresses is to never give up your dream. No matter how many doors close in your face, if you really want this, you will get it. Stay true to yourself and let your talent shine for all the world to see. Work hard and don't let anyone discourage you. You will succeed. Thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. And um, I will see you next time then. Of course, darling. I've enjoyed talking with you. Until next time, my love. I'll be there cooking dinner. Bye. I'll be looking forward to that. Goodbye, my love.